A corridor teen is making great progress after undergoing a major life-saving surgery. Good evening. I'm Scott Sanborn. Tiffany is off tonight. Haley Steimel continues to recover from her Valentine's Day heart transplant and be an inspiration to many others. CBS 2 News reporter Kevin Barry joins us in the studio after sitting down with Haley, her mom Bridget, and her sister Hope. Kevin? Scott, the Steinmel family knows that they're lucky that everything worked out and Haley is healthy. Now they're looking forward to getting back to normal, but also to help others with what they've learned. When you're in the hospital for weeks and weeks, a little humor can go a long way. After Haley's heart transplant, one of her nurses brought something in. She gave me a present. One was a tin man. And she's like, well, this is kind of like the tin man wanting a heart. So now you got your heart. While the scarecrow looks for wisdom, the lion seeks courage. The Tin Man needs a heart to find compassion. It turns out Haley might have him beat there. I, I got my heart, so now I want to help other people. And so I just say, just, you know, sign up and be an organ donor. With everything Haley's gone through, and now that she's strong enough to throw out the first pitch at a Colonel's game, <laughs> Haley's heart may not be the only thing that's new for her and her sister Hope. It's their outlook on life. I don't know what, but I want something big to come out of this and like make an impact. An impact after Bridget says Hope and her older sister Hannah basically took over the house when Haley was in the hospital and Bridget was by her side. They had to grow up really quickly. I mean, it makes you really proud that when um, things got tough, they knew exactly what to do. One time when they might not be so sure what to do, when they meet the donor's family. You can imagine how hard it would be to find the words for someone who lost so much but gave you everything. I think like when you're in that moment and you're meeting the family, I think then you're going to know what to say. So while the Tin Man might get some smiles, it's not the present that makes Haley think every day. I'm going to keep this heart healthy and strong because someone gave it to me for a gift. Bridget says the focus now is just on getting back to normal, and if all goes according to plan, Haley should be able to start her senior year of high school back with her classmates. Kevin Barry, CBS 2 News, 10 at 10.